All right, looks like I got enough people to do my FAQ or AQ since these questions aren't exactly frequent. But anyways, here we go. Just so you know, I have a cold, so that's kind of the reason that I'm, I sound kind of congested. But you'll just have to get past that. Sorry. All right. Question number one. From the Full Metal Calculus, male or female? Really? Really? I, I mean, you're making me think that my voice is like the pitch of a three-year-old girl or something. And my name, my, my name is Mr. Bullet Guy. I mean, how more obvious could I make it? Of course I'm a girl. Question number two, also from the Full Metal Calculus. How is the progress for the next episode of Super Mario RPG abridged? Hmm, progress, let me just check that up, and it's zero. Yeah, as I've mentioned in several videos, uh, it's not because I haven't been trying to work on it at least. It's just I had problems. I had all the footage recorded that I needed. It's just it all got deleted somehow. It was that, that was like back in the fall, though, and I just haven't had time to record again. I'll, I'll try again in May when I'm supposed to get my new computer laptop thing, but you're just going to have to wait till then. I'm sorry. And last question from Full Metal Calculus. Pudding! I couldn't agree more. My next question from Cody Me 12 What do you have against Canada? Is it their bacon? Or the fact that their police are called Mounties? Answer this question or else Canada will nuke its one true enemy, talking bullets that wear glasses. A little tongue face thing. And you misspelled the word bullet. Nice job there. <sighs> Looks like I'm going to have to go find the rant. Yeah, you guys from Skype, you probably know the rant. Here, let me find it. <clears throat> Canadians plan to sell Canadian bacon to all those stupid Americans, but it's not bacon. Bacon is crispy and delicious. Canadian bacon is just sliced ham. Yes, just sliced freaking ham. So why do they sell it to us? They make it more expensive pound for pound than regular ham. We Americans buy it and take all the profits. And then, then they will use that profit to start a mass nuclear war, starting with the most powerful countries, namely the U.S., Britain, and Japan. Then they'll make more money off of our old money makers, including anime and video games. After they've taken over the market, they will sell tobacco and alcohol to third world countries, thus destroying their economy, government, and military. They will rule the world, and that is why I hate Canada. Does that answer your question? Good. Question number five from Jordioto1. Do you eat bark? Well, due to the fact that I am part porcupine, I do eat bark on occasions. Question number six from the Diver Guy 93 Will you do game reviews? That's an interesting question. Um, like I said with uh, Full Metal Calculus' question, I have trouble getting footage. Uh, so don't expect any anytime soon. But it is an idea I have toyed with a little bit. So don't be surprised if I do do a video game review in the future, because it is an idea that, it sounds kind of cool, I guess. Question number seven, also from the Diver Guy 93 will you continue your bridge series? It's going to be a while, but I do really hope so. It's something I really want to do, and if all goes well, it's going to start up again eventually. And there is another series I want to do. Also, I want to try and get the next episode of Mario RPG out first, but there is something else I really want to do, so just be prepared for that. Question number eight from Frodo's Gamecast. What's your IQ? You know, I'm really not sure. I've never actually taken the time to check or take an IQ test. It's probably somewhere around the thousand range. If I had to, you know, take a guess, you know, that might be pushing it a little bit. Okay, question number nine. VBoys21 asks, do you wear boxers or briefs? I actually don't wear either. I wear boxer briefs. They provide all the support of briefs, but all the comfort of boxers. Question 10. Dear Mr. Bullet Guy, how are you so awesome? Well, I don't know. I just am. And hopefully by watching these videos, some of my awesomeness will rub off on you. Question number 11 from my good friend, Zelda Game God. What do you think about Project Needlemouse and Sonic's future in general? 
Should I just let the character die if the next game isn't up to par, or just keep working at it? Okay, for those of you who don't know, Project Needlemouse is a sort of code name for um, a new Sonic game that uh, Sonic Team and Sega are working on. Um, there's not much known about it. All we know is that it's going to be two-dimensional side-scroller, just like old Sonic games. Um, to be honest, I'm looking quite forward to it. But I wouldn't, I'm not really too worried about it, Z uh, ZGG. I know you've expressed kind of worries in the past, but in truth, Sonic uh, side-scroller's never been bad. I mean, even nowadays. I mean, the Sonic Advance series were all good, and Sonic Rush isn't half bad. And then there's Sonic Rivals, which is... Kind of a spin-off, I guess, but it was still wasn't a bad game. In fact, the worst Sonic uh, side-scrolling I've seen was on Sonic Unleashed. So, I'm really not too worried about it. As for your worries about um, Sonic in general in his future, well, they better, they got a lot of work to do. I mean, I'm not worried about their side-scrollers, but their 3D games suck. I I'm, not, I'm not even going to buy anymore unless I hear that they get a good rating. And the next next three D Sonic game I hear needs to be Sonic Adventure three, or else I am going to tear my hair out. Now, should they let the character die? I'm not so sure, but they gotta do some things. I don't want to need this rail crap that's in Sonic and the Secret Rings and Sonic and the Black Knight. No swords. That's for Link. Uh, I don't want to see any werehogs or any of that crap. I don't want to see any Olympics. Just give me Sonic, please. No more gimmicks. No more crap. No more hoverboards, for one. Just... Ugh, now you got me ranting about Sonic. Just... If they can't come out with a decent 3D game, they should just stick to 2D. Hope that answers your question. Question number 12 from J1994M. Nice name. Do you need in any voices for your videos? In truth, I'm not gonna be releasing any videos with any other one, with anyone else voicing in any time in the near future. Um, but if I do, I will either uh, put out an audition video where I say, "Here, audition for this character, or this character, or this character," or I will just um, come to you. Don't come to me. I'll come to you. Don't worry about that. Um, but don't expect anything like that anytime soon, okay? Question number 13 from the Cookie Bandit 18 Can I glomp you? Oh, this is Jarrus22. Oh, Jarrus must have had to make a new account. Uh, no, Jarrus, no, you can't because you're a Jew and uh, I don't like you. No, no, I'm just kidding. I don't really hate you. But you still can't glomp me. Question 14 from Stony Wolf. I don't know. Do you think cake is a lie? You know, this is probably one of the questions that keeps me up at night. Is cake a lie? Is just everything we know in this world just a lie put on by some form of higher intelligence? Or is it real? You know what? I don't really care if the cake is a lie. Because I enjoy it anyway. And if it is a lie, I'm the happiest delusional fellow around. And final question, also from Stony Wolfa. Yes or no? Hmm. 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 Yes. Well, I hope that's, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that and, uh, have a nice day, I guess. But one thing I do want to ask you guys about is that there's this whole big thing going on in Haiti right now. I'm sure you all have heard earthquakes have hit. And I just want to encourage you guys to donate a little bit of money to some sort of relief effort if you have one. Maybe you can go, maybe you could uh, uh, try to convince uh, your school to hold some sort of uh, fundraiser. I guess. I mean, I went through Katrina, so I can I can't I still can't even imagine what kind of pain these guys are going through. I still had my house afterwards, but so please, guys, just help them out. What they're going through is a hundred million times worse than anything you've ever gone through. So, I guess this is my little uh, being nice action for the year. So, peace out, guys. Oh, and guys, don't forget to ask me more questions. You can either 
ask me questions under this video, or you can do the one where I actually requested questions. You, just keep it up, guys. Um, so I, I enjoyed doing this, and I uh, hope you did too, so keep asking questions.